In another development, the Ghanaian Foreign Affairs Ministry has refuted an early press statement warning its citizens from traveling to the Nigeria's federal capital territory over insecurity. The second statement released says the initial statement was unauthorized. The Ghanaian authority also denies knowledge of any threats targeted at its nationals living in Abuja. Moyo Thomas reports. A statement released to the media by the Ghanaian Ministry of Foreign Affairs and Regional Integration, not signed, but stamped, warned its citizens from traveling to Nigeria's capital, Abuja, over insecurity and other issues. This statement was immediately countered by a second media release, still not signed, retracting the earlier statement saying it was unauthorized. The retraction was also posted on the High Commission's Twitter handle, where Nigerians have reacted, mostly in disgust, at the words used in the earlier statement. The statement says, The public is advised to avoid non-essential travel to Abuja due to unpredictable security situation in the city and high danger of terrorism, criminality, intercommunal conflict, armed attacks and kidnappings. The Ghanaian High Commission in Abuja has also sent a statement saying the publication has been redrawn by the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and Regional Integration of the Republic of Ghana, regretting any inconvenience that this may have caused to the government and people of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. The statement generated reactions from Nigerians. The British High Commission has already downgraded the security threat in Abuja, changing the level from amber to green. Muya Thomas, TVC News, Abuja.